starts now. Good evening. He attended there as a student, but now as a coach, he's facing serious charges. The high school basketball coach facing sexual misconduct allegations. McFarland Unified School District officials confirming an investigation is underway and say student safety is their top priority. 23 ABC's Amanda Mason has been following the story and joins us with more on what's next in the case. Amanda. Well, the McFarland Unified School District sent out a statement in both English and Spanish regarding the recent arrest of McFarland High School's boys basketball coach. Now, the district stated right here, as you can see, this is the letter that student safety and well-being is a very high priority in our schools and the district is concerned about the welfare of the victim. Sunday afternoon, McFarland High School boys basketball coach Fernando Perneda was arrested by the Kern County Sheriff's Department for alleged sexual misconduct with a minor, according to the statement released by the McFarland Unified School District. This particular employee has been empl uh, employed with us for approximately five years, beginning with in a part-time role and more recently in a full-time role. Perneda, a graduate of McFarland High School, started working at McFarland High School in 2013 as a part-time coach and athletic attendant in charge of local rooms, fields, and athletic equipment. And in 2016, became a full-time boys basketball coach and athletic attendant and was also a baseball assistant coach. Well, we say that if you know something, you should say something. And so if there's a, a student or anyone else that has any other information that could potentially be related to this, we ask that they contact a local law enforcement or the contact us here at the school district office. Since his arrest on Sunday, he has been put on paid administrative leave because of automatic legal protection with the education system pending the investigations into the allegations. Now, the case is still under investigation and there is still no information under inmate search for anyone by that name. Now, arrest records do show these numbers right here. This is from the Kern County Sheriff's Office and we looked up each number. So 288.4 is child molesting under age 14, 247.6 is child molesting under 18, and 288.2 is sending images slash content to a minor. Now we're still working on reaching out to KCSO, but have not been able to get a hold of anyone. 23ABC also reached out to Perneda and stopped by his last known residence, but no one wanted to comment. In studio, Amanda Mason, 23ABC. Baker, so